And new at 10 tonight, a new idea in Aiken County. A school board member suggesting the district start randomly drug testing some students. Wes Cooper is live in the newsroom tonight. Wes, he says the idea here is to be preventative. Right, John. Brian Silas believes by implementing a random drug test policy for specific Aiken County students would deter drug use. He says he was inspired by a concerned parent, and after doing his own research, he brought up the idea to his fellow school board members. If we can prevent one student, you know, from getting involved in drugs, developing into something more serious, I think it's worth it. Right now, only Aiken County bus drivers are drug tested randomly, but school board member Brian Silas is hoping to change that by testing student athletes and those in marching bands. It could be others, but, but that was the focus right now. Silas introduced the testing idea at this week's board meeting. I wanted other board members to have a chance to read, investigate, talk to people, talk to their uh, constituents, uh, and give them time to look into it before I brought it to the board for, for a vote. The policy would be similar to what other South Carolina school districts have in place. Some studies show extracurricular participation did not go down where there are drug testing policies. One of the biggest benefits of this program is that we've heard and you can read about is that it, is it gives students an out. It gives them a reason to say no when they're pressured to use drugs, right? That's one of the biggest benefits of it is no, I can't. And the reason I can't is because I want to play my sport. Aiken County schools already have strict rules against illegal drug use. Teachers and students can be punished if the rules are broken. Silas says the policy he would like to see enacted is geared more towards helping students. It's not going to involve law enforcement. It's not to produce a record that will follow that student through their career or when they get through with school. It's simply to make parents know if there's a problem so it can be intervened with and that student can get counseling. Silas says the drug test more than likely would be urine samples and student selection would be computerized. It's a random program all done by the district office. It's not for cause and uh, all that comes from the district level and a third party would likely be involved to do the testing. Silas hopes to bring his drug testing idea back up for a motion at the next Aiken County School Board meeting so a policy can be developed, then the policy itself would be up for a vote. John.